Good afternoon guys, um, today we are going to look at a feature called add-ons and it will basically give you just more versatility in the product to be able to take engravings um, just conf take more I suppose variable options for each product so you get to the new menu by navigating to log into your account navigate to your dashboard go to settings and you'll see now a new feature here add-ons so you click add-ons so we have zero add-ons here so we want to create an add-on for a product so we in this case are going to create an add-on for engravings okay and uh, you can leave a priority number and we're going to apply to all products in our store so it'll apply to every product that we have all the options we do here can be done on a product by product basis so instead of doing it uh, let's just publish that engravings first so if we want to do it to individual products we will go back to the dashboard and we will go to products and we will go into a green jersey and we can do the exact same thing as we're going to do in the other menu we can do it here on each individual product if they all have different configurables but in this case we're going to do it just to every product in our store so we're going to go to add-ons and we now have an engravings add-on that will apply to every product so we want to edit that so it's currently just applied to every product the names engravings so now we want to add a field that will appear on our product so we add a field um, and here are the field types so there is different options here but in this case we are going to go with a short text box and um, we can restrict it to be just text just numbers and um, an email address whatever we want but in this case because we're looking at an engraving we're going to leave out any text and uh, title record is going to be engraving and we're going to format this instead of being a label we're going to change it to a heading so it's just going to be a heading then and um, we can add a description uh, so it'd be please place your text here uh, we can make it record or not record in this case we're going to go not record uh, we can limit the character count so say it's a little piece of jewelry you might only have room for 10 letters so we just limit the character count to 10 um, and we can adjust the price accordingly so we can apply a flat fee of five euros if anybody wants to um, we can put a quantity based on it so when someone orders one of them it'll go five if someone orders two it'll be ten maybe someone orders three it'll be fifteen and so on so forth so forth or we can do a percentage base so if we want to be twenty percent of whatever the product price is that's what this field will do so we are going to just update that field now and we will go back to our dashboard and we'll go into any product here and um, i've just migrated this from a customer so it's it's in um we're working in a staging environment so nothing here is live and um, if we go into the product and we view it in the store You'll now see now that there's a 20% price on engraving. Please, please place your text. So we're going to put uh, green. And you can see the character count going down. Um, is it won't let me type anything else. So it has limited the character count to what we've told it. And you can see the 20% engraving. It's going to tell you what engraving you want on the chain and it's going to give you the price and um, we're going to add that to the basket sorry about this mouse keep coming up and um, view the basket okay and you can see that it's on the vendor and engraving and the price we're going to select uh, a delivery option and check it um, yep so we're going to continue on here and this is all uh, sandbox so it's this is not a live store so I can print any 
details here, it's not going to make any difference. And I place the order. So now you'll see that the order has been placed uh, to the vendor. Um, and the engraving for 760 is lovely. That's all for this feature for engraving as an add-on.